A very common problem for classic car owners to have is, is bulbs that won't work. In a lot of cases, you know, it's not only just a burnt bulb, it can be corrosion in the sockets. These cars have been around for 50, 60, 70 years. And, you know, things like corner marker lights are notorious where they, you know, in, despite it having a gasket on the lens and, and ha having a lens over the socket, they still get moisture and humidity and they're exposed to the elements. So the, the sockets on these bulbs tend to actually start to corrode. And really, whenever you're doing any, you know, whether it be your, your classic car or any car, you should always consider putting some dielectric grease on the, uh, the bulb itself before you put it in the socket. Dielectric grease is not like petroleum grease. It's not like Vaseline or anything like that. It's, uh, dielectric grease is silicone based. It's silicone grease and silicone will transmit electricity for short distances and so when the contacts are in place against the, uh, when your contacts are in place against the bulb in the back of the socket, uh, they will make an actual connection. But the advantage of the dielectric grease is it keeps out moisture, it keeps out corrosion, and, uh, you know, ensures that your batteries or, or your, ensures that your bulbs are going to actually function properly. Uh, this is a, you know, I think it's a must for classic cars, not only for your signal lights, but for your headlights and anywhere where you're going to, uh, you know, your bulbs are going to be exposed to the elements. And, uh, but also if you have a car trailer or something like that, you know, car trailers are notorious for the bulbs not working properly because, because of corrosion. And uh, uh, an easy way to get around that is to use dielectric grease and it'll ensure that your bulbs function properly.